Before we get into any of that, let's go with our weekly awards, the D1 Rejects Weekly Awards. Uh, we're going to start with our Game of the Week selections for Week 10 here. And if we take a look at these, the one you will realize, that's why we're having the, the guys on uh, tonight, at least the one from Missouri Western, this game was incredible. I'm going to pause it. I want to play the audio on this and set the scene a little bit for you. Pittsburgh State, the number two team in the country, undefeated, obviously undefeated in MIAA. Missouri Western, they play sports. Spoiler, excuse me. They play spoiler 31 to 30. Pitt State's got one more chance to make this happen. Listen to the call on this is incredible. Pit 30, fourth and 13, Gorillas at the Griffin 33. Pennington in the gun, two receivers each way. Back to throw, gets hit, the ball is free. Western recovered, Western recovered. Dakari Streeter, the strip sack, and his buddy, That's the awesome. six-year Griffin, the three-time all of my double-A senior, CJ. That, like, that's awesome. The energy in that call, we talk with Jonas later about this. That moment, that entire game uh, was just fun to watch and be a part of. And this final moment kind of summarized it. By the way, the black uniforms for the Griffins there, some of the cleanest in Division Two. Those are incredibly clean. With the yellow cleats as well, whoo. Missouri Western pulls off a huge win there. They're seeing themselves uh, almost cemented into the regional rankings. Division three side of things, another WIAC contest. Uh, there were great picks at all levels. Obviously, there could have been uh, different suggestions, uh, but we chose this one because of the playoff implications right here in this one. You got lacrosse taking a close win, a nail-biter win over River Falls. River Falls going for a field goal very late at the end of this one, and they come through and block it to seal the win with only like four seconds to go. Lacrosse has just been playing out of their minds. This win seals and clinches at least a share of the WIAC championship and a home playoff game. While River Falls now, you're looking at a team that it's probably going to be one of the first ones out of the playoffs. We'll talk more about that with Jimmy later. Uh, a team that's been in the call resistance bowl the last two years, not where they wanted to end up at the end of this one. Still a fantastic football game. NAI side of things. Dort takes down Morningside. Morningside had won who knows how many GPAC conference games in a row. I believe it was up in the 70s before this matchup. Dort comes in and knocks them right off. 28-24, the defenders take down the Mustangs. The Mustangs' only other loss this year was uh, to number one Northwestern College. They were actually featured uh, on the wrong side of a couple Game of the Week selections. But shout out to Dort for making those big time plays. They are a force to be reckoned with over there in Iowa. <laughs>